Um, well, yeah, so here comes another cutscene. Enjoy it! Damn it. I have no idea how you would survive out here on your own. Just push the button, lady. I hope I don't have to do everything for you. Well, what are you waiting for? Just admiring your skills. Looks like Frank is about to take a Cialis and go to town on that ass. No, I'm kidding. Um, so, yeah. Um, I don't even know what to say anymore. I've been recording too long. <laughs> I'm just recording until dinner time, and then I'm going to stop for the night, and then I'll record again tomorrow. Woo! So I'm hoping this live commentary turns out well, and I'm able to sync it up properly, because if I can't, then I'm fucked. Uh, I'm going to pick up the fire axe. It's terrible. I mean, it, it's like not even a one-hit kill, but... Uh, I mean, you'd think the fire axe would be a one-hit kill. But it doesn't seem to be. Oh well. So, it just chops off their arms. And for some reason, their arms don't turn to hunk of meat. I've, I've always wanted... Like, uh, if the fire axe was going to be handy, I thought it would, like... <sighs> you know, turn their hands or their arms into hunk of meat, and then you can use the hunk of meat as a weapon. That would be pretty cool. I would have liked that. That would have been a nice twist. But then again, the hunk of meat is mainly the hand, but... You can cut off the hand. Uh, there's nothing in here I want to make. Uh, no, there's no gems around. Screw it. Um, so, yeah, let's just get into this other cutscene. Ooh, so many cutscenes. God damn. Enjoy. I mean, like, there is a lot, so sorry about that. Here, let me try. They didn't teach me that in journalism school. You went to journalism school? <laughs> Could have fooled me. What a mess. Well, this just gets better and better. Wow, looks like somebody didn't like the show much. You should get this on video. to see what really went down. Frank, check this out. Hmm. Zombies don't use guns. I'm not so sure Kira's not involved, but it definitely proves someone's covering up what really happened. Not a bad lead, kiddo. Now it's time to show me those pictures, Frank. Frank. You need to get back to the bunker now. What is it, Stacy? It's Sullivan. He saw the report. Can you get back here? He's threatening to kick me out. I'm on my way. Hello? Wait, who is that? Just a friend. Stacy, the leader of Cure. Gotta go. He can't ditch me for long. Okay. Got something? I can see two guys in Shank's knife shop at the Palisades. Oh. Better hurry. I don't know how long they can hold out. Sorry I wasn't talking. Or actually I was. I'm just going to edit that out because I was talking with my mom and she doesn't like being on the uh, YouTube, so I'm going to actually just edit all that out, so uh, yeah, uh, what, what's happening now is there's a slight difference in the story. Um, originally in Dead Rising 2, you were just, you were supposed to be the one that's getting threatened to kick to be kicked out because uh, you're Chuck Green and you caused it, but um, now it's just Cure because they had to switch it up a bit to make it make sense. And uh, yeah, so now we're going to head on back there. Doris wasn't up there, so that means that Chad isn't going to be up there either shooting the shit out of me. The fucking stupidest thing, though, is Chad is such a dumb fucking NPC. He'll just shoot the shit out of you every time you try to talk to him, and it's fucking retarded. I've almost died from him so many times. 
and I don't even know what to say. Like you'll you'll see. Trust me, you'll see. Because it happened every time I talked to him. So, I mean, I, I've been lucky and I didn't die. So, maybe you will be too. I really doubt it, but maybe, maybe, just maybe. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna head back and do case one four unless I get a phone call or I mean, not like a phone call, but a uh, call from Stacy saying, "Oh, hey, there's someone over there. You might want to save them." But uh, oh, I didn't get a call from Moe's Imagination. See, I, this is why I don't like this. Really I had I didn't get a call for this place. See, I was supposed to get a call as soon as I left for case one one, but no, never got that fucking call. All right, talk to you. Let's get inside here. I'm gonna get the battle axes. See if there's anything else in here I want. Ooh, what's that over there? Whoa, two million dollars. Yeah, no, bro, I'm cool. Yeah, I'll just get with. The, I'll just stick with the battle axes. Always a pleasure, you know, buddy. stick with the original stuff. Great. There goes my retirement fund. People have been using them for hundreds of years. Can't what, you be think I made that bad. Money? Oops. There we go. And let's see. I've got time. I'm going to go to Uranus Zone on a tricycle because I'm that manly. Eee, I'm so manly. Look at how fast I go. Yeah, so fast. Look at me go. Yeah, I'm so German. I'm in the little tricycle, you know. Yeah, so cool. <laughs> I don't know why I did that accent, but tricycle is just so manly. You could just. Uh, well, it's a, I think it's faster than walking. I'm not entirely sure. But it, it's just so entertaining. I mean, just look at my little legs go. They're just so fast. I don't understand how they're going so fast, yet I'm going so slow. Uh, yes. Oh, I got a call for welcome to the family. I don't remember that. Okay. I must not have been paying attention. Okay. So I will go do the vaults, get the Zombrex, and then I will go to... Atlantica Casino, and then go into Palisades, and then save the family, which I think is still referenced from uh, Avenged Sevenfold song, Welcome to the Family. Welcome to the family. Hey, do I have your attention? I know the way you build them. That was my really, really bad impression, and I hope you guys couldn't hear that. See, that, that's the frame rate I'm talking about. See that? Oh, my God. The one issue in this game. Oh well. Hooray, I'm a very manly man. I wonder if I can get on that ledge, because I wasn't able to get on that one. So let's see if I can get on this. Nope. Wasn't able to. Oh no. Oh, I've been hit. Man down! Oh yeah, I might as well get the 10 grand from here. Oh, come on. Three? Three this time? Really? Oh well. Oh, I can't wait. I'm having tacos tonight. I love tacos. Oh, si, senor. Taco. Totally just like mow your lawn, dude. That was so racist. Anyways, sorry. I had to do it. I mean, there was tacos and everything. Uh, I forgot what it was. Was it 185? Oh, 673. Oh, yes. There's the Zombrex. And for some reason, gems as well. Uh, now, what was the other one? 185? Was it? Let's see. Sweet. Yes, there we go. Ten grand. Okay, that's better than a hundred bucks. So, got another ten grand. Uh, and then here's another ten grand. Here I'm gonna get. I don't know who keeps reply like re like restoring that. I, who keeps building the ATMs? That's what pisses me off. Well, it doesn't really piss me off. It's just I I wonder how the fuck do they keep coming back? I mean. Like, there's just, is there just, like, one guy they call during a zombie apocalypse who's like, Oh, hey, by the way, uh, according to your contract, you fix ATMs whenever. Uh, there's a zombie apocalypse, and this guy keeps stealing all our money, so just repair it for us, okay? I would say no. I'd just be like, fuck you. I quit. Uh, but on the contract, it says, uh, if you quit, we're allowed to steal your soul and sell it to Satan. Aw, oh, damn. Oh, oh well. Okay, uh, so there's a bloody knife down there. Didn't want to pick that up. Might get AIDS. Uh, let's see. So, in case you didn't know where this is, this is that bar that's across from the Venus Touch where you can get the hair, and this is the bar where you get the Space Girl suit in order to get Frank Crossdresser. Or one of the things you can get to get Frank Crossdresser. I just prefer using it because it's easier. And uh, it's in one of my other videos if you guys 
need help finding it. And uh, you just go up here, jump on this ledge. It's near the Atlantica Casino entrance. And boom! Right. There is the next Zombrex. That's uh, one of the hidden ones on the map that I know of. I know there's one underground, and there's one on the roof of the safe house. But I haven't gone there yet. I don't know if I can get there without it 